What's up, YouTube? It's your boy. I'm back with another video. Long time no see, y'all. But we got some big news for Power Book 2 Season 4. So the last episode's trailer has just came out today. Here, I cannot post the full trailer, but I'm still going to try to show some of the important parts. But also, I could show most of the important pictures from this trailer. So let's start. First, we see Don Carter pull up on Monet, Tariq, and Diana. You see him with his gun out, and it looks like it's pointed at Monet. We know for the rest of these episodes, Don Carter means straight business. He's going to do everything in his power to bring Tariq down. This dude has a deep hatred for Tariq. We're going to see a lot of rule bending, a lot of illegal shit from Don Carter, him breaking a lot of rules just to take Tariq and Monet down. And also, we know that Celine Body is going to pop up and Don Carter is going to find out about this. And his first choice suspect is going to be Tariq. So things are going to be heating up. Next, we see that Tasha's back and her and Tariq are hugging. Tariq just wants a soft, regular good life for his mom. But does Tasha make it to the end of this season? Man, that's in question. What do y'all think? So, damn, it's looking like Diana caught a body, a vicious one at that. Like, this reminds me of the body ghost caught in jail. Like, it looks like she's smashing somebody's head in with a weight. Who could this be? B. Could Diana possibly be trying to save somebody? And this is crazy given her circumstances with her having a kid and trying to live this life, trying to leave this life alone and all that. She's back to this. What could be happening here? Y'all let me know y'all opinions in the comment section. But it looks like everybody's on time in this season. Next we see Brayden is up in his gun at somebody. Like he's about to use it. Now who could this be? Could it be L? Because Brayden already told her way too much last season. He told her the whole business. He started pillow talking and all. Who could it be? There's a lot of options here. Y'all let me know y'all opinions and theories in the comment section. These next episodes are definitely looking violent and action-packed. And that's great because Power's definitely making up for that part one finale because that was not it. So Rashad Tate is back. So that can only really mean one thing, that his brother Kamal is dead. And also in this picture, it looks like Tate is in an autopsy room. So who took out Kamal? Could it have been Drew? Could it have been the task force? And look at Tate's face here in this picture, man. He looks stressed out. He looks really messed up. Tate's back here to shake things up this season. We know Tate is one of the dirtiest politicians in the game. It's definitely going to be interesting. Next, we see Noma threatening Tariq with a razor. You see, she puts it to his neck. You know, Noma has not forgotten what happened last season with Tariq getting close with her daughter and is now using her daughter as leverage against her. She wants to take Tariq out, and Tariq wants her out of here, too. So these two are going to be low-key going at it this whole season. I know Tariq has the perfect master plan in effect to finally get rid of this girl, and I know he's going to execute it, man. Noma is going to be dead or in jail by the end of this season. Y'all let me know some of y'all predictions for Noma. Next, we see Zion shooting at the club. Trying to hit at Kane, and he got Kane ducking. Zion ain't leaving this situation alone. Zion ain't forgot about that fight. He ain't gonna let that shit go to rest. It's gonna be funny as hell, especially between these two this season. They're gonna be going at it. Next, we see Drew ends up in jail. Now, for what? Could it be what happened to Kamal? What could it have been, man? Drew, out of all people, ends up being the one in jail. That would be crazy if like this is like one of the like last scenes. And it's like Drew going for murder or something. But y'all let me know some of y'all theories, man. Leave some of y'all opinions in the comment section of what y'all think is about to happen to Drew. What does he do to put himself in this position? But part two for season four is definitely looking like it's one of them ones. It's going to be one of the best seasons to come out so far. And them ratings is going to be crazy. But also, Effie is a big question because they haven't really dove into Effie's character yet. Like, her character hasn't really developed these like seasons like we thought they would so what could they be doing for effie can it be effie's final season also we gonna find out i just wanted to add that in at the end because that's something that i've been thinking about y'all also talk about that in the comment section let me know what y'all think but it's your boy i'm out i'm gonna try to stay consistent you know the more news that comes out i'll continue to bring it to you guys